Good evening, lads and lasses. My name is All Altitude, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. What is this on the chair? It's a creepy ass doll. Where we left off, we just got all the heads to finish this statue, and that's what we're going to do right now. Place a serpent head in its little podium up here. Yeah, and if I had to assume, I feel like I know what this room is, if I'm being completely honest. It involves a lot of uh, big flying bugs. But I'm- um, oh! Leon! The stairs! Stay back. Uh oh. Oh boy, are we fighting for our life here. Oh wait, no, is this the Ashley section? the Ashley part? Rescue Leon. Anything here? I got a lantern. There's gotta be like a way out, right? Oh. The door came down. Exotic animals from America. Don't scare me like that. Ha, <laughs> right. Yeah? Don't you dare. Is that a Don't clock? you dare. Way to the hidden mausoleum. The resting forebears answer to the chosen time. It is the Lord's blessing you seek. Have courage and fear no darkness. So four bears. I'm guessing that's very literal. Well, it looks like the way I must go. But at the same time, I don't know what the... You know, time is to set that clock. I saw that autosave game. You can't fool me. That must be my way out. Or way out of this area. Prometheus? Probably not.
Well, Ashley's a little bit tankier. Well, it's like moves like a tank. Bunch of keys. No, 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 stop it. You stop that sass right now, Mister. No, I don't appreciate it. <gasps> no way. Wait, light, pluggers, light. It, it stopped. That's right, bitch. So Leon's trapped. So this time Leon's trapped, and we gotta figure out a way to get him out. What's this slot for? The insignia. The key to getting out of this confound place is the Salazar family insignia. To find it, I must venture to where the cursed armor awaits, the underground mausoleum. Eh. Blue light protects your forever faithful servant.
step. It was, it's practically like right below us. Like right there. Wait a second. Also, shut up, Discord. I heard you. Seem to have aggroed, so I think we're fine for the time. Bye sometime. No, that's you can't do that. You can't no, you can't. You you just can't. I am done with our Not that bad, just don't know why they felt the need to stick a plaga into it. <laughs> uh, oh hey, that's a uh, joust a, sh a jousting uh, pauldron. So typically, during jousting, knights wouldn't wear just you know normal armor like that. I mean, you're riding on a horse with a massive stick going like 30 to 40 miles an hour towards someone. So believe it or not, for safety. They created these pauldrons that you're supposed to impact, because essentially you hit the shoulder of a knight hard enough, they'll basically go flying off the back of their horse. So for safety, they basically designed these pauldrons that are meant to take the impact of a, jo of a large jousting, uh, jousting pole. And some of them would wear much larger uh, neck guards, just in case they were to go a little too far to the left. Why can't I have one of those? All armor is designed with a purpose. Uh. 
so hawkfish deer snake Really? Oh, come on. This isn't fair. thought that crickling creaking was them trying to move. Yeah, I got that. Thanks. Didn't I just say I was done? So there's a deer. Deer. Fish. Actually, I think they're just, I think they're all in this room. In the space. Thank you. I don't want any more. So the blue light should stop him. So two and four still have to have yet to be used. And these are pretty big to be long swords. I think they're more either great swords or Zweihanders. Which is just German the for heck? great sword, but still. The moon! Picking up what you're putting down. The star, the full, and the crescent. So, if I were to just put one of these helmets on, would they just not be able to tell who I am? Like a Freddy Fazbear mask? No, no, don't go out! Again? I've had enough of this! Wait, the lanterns are gone? Okay, the game knows what I'm trying to do. Or what I was going to do. Why do you gotta be such a putz? Mm. <laughs> Let me guess, you come to life too. Oh my god, you can see them going all through the armor.
So that's what an enemy of the king feels like when they're being pursued. Oh, fucking K. You wanna know what's funny is that this Plaga is obviously intelligent enough to know how to walk without an actual hose and wield weapons, but it's not smart enough to recognize, you know, a danger. Ain't that something. Wait, what? What? Oh, the stairwell. What a laugh if it just hit the fucking bars and bounced away. Gotcha. It's like, well, shit. Yeah, I think so. Ashley! Ah, uh, one of the henchmen. That chapter was only like uh, 24 minutes. Uh, I can go a little bit longer. I can go a bit longer. Thought about taking a break, but I can go like another like 20, 25 minutes before doing that. Motion. Everything will work out just fine. As long as you can keep your dog under control. He's a good boy. Is that is that Wesker? Fine. Keep your mutt. But don't come crying to me if you get bit. Obviously, I wouldn't have seen all of these possible treasures through all of these rooms if the game didn't want me to go down there. So, you know. 
You know. Same as ever. It's quite possible. I seek a brave soul willing to dispose of that monstrosity of a knight. Be warned, it is much stronger than the others. You can cut down our best with a single strike. Defeat the strong str no, I bet I bet it I'm gonna guess it's the uh I'm gonna guess it's the golden knight. And the funny thing is, it's full of fucking living knights now. I still gotta finish that little side contract. You know, like the uh, mice in the place, the library. I mean, obviously, I'm gonna. I have to try and get some of this loot down here. Wow, standing all fucking pretty for me, huh? Asshole. Okay. Fine. Okay, that's new, that's new, that's new, that's new. Don't touch me, get off me. I don't like that. I don't consent. Why won't you die? Oh, already. May as well. Did he, did he ignored my armor too, I'm pretty sure. That, or you just did so much damage, it felt like my armor didn't do jack diddly squat. Don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me, you asshole. Oh, cool, I'm getting fucked in a corner. Can I just? No, I can't. Da, 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 da. God, you are a big son of a bitch. Who creates armor in that size? Also, I'd like for this helmet to come off by now. Oh, it's on its back! This whole time I've been wasting ammo!
Wow, this whole time I wasted ammo. Yeah, that's right. God damn it. This whole fucking time. Four shotgun rounds. Less than a hundred handgun rounds. Oh cool, hand grenades. I'd rather have bullets, but okay. I got them now. Oh, well. Asking you shall receive, I suppose. Wait, 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 nah. Well, I got a bullet. I'm just, you know, th I'm still thinking about that semi-auto rifle. To the lion's den. You fucking kidding me? I'll be right back. All right, where were we? Oh yes, we were going to the library. Excuse me. Tells me the flashlight doesn't do anything, so I'm gonna go. Up the stairs, Leon, let's go. High power, high fire rate, well, well, no accuracy, that's what it is. Mmm. Wow. The fuck do I do it? How do I... Oh, what ammo does this even take? 
Like five five six, I imagine. Does it take rifle ammo? No, it's for a long rifle. Had the keys. Shit. Well, that ain't good. Well, guess I gotta backtrack. I'll go the scenic route. Cat on that plate. Took care of her requested. Where do I even find the ammo for that thing? That's my grandiose question. I don't even know where to find the ammo for that. But regardless... Really want to use it. Yeah. <laughs> I can tell by the look on your face. <laughs> well done! You've proven yourself reliable. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What's that? How have we procured these curiosities? <laughs> you don't want to know. Come. Back anytime. All right. I think we're good to encounter the Novistadors. Oh, yeah, look at that. Mm -mm. Fucking monsters. So that's what they look like now. Some 
more gunpowder. <coughs> First aid's breath. Two years since my awakening, Master Ramon has bestowed upon me a truly righteous undertaking to improve upon the flaws of our human form, to seek perfection as observed in our ethropodial ethro <coughs> fuck ethropodial siblings. To this cause, I shall willingly devote my life. January, four years since my awakening, my efforts to transfuse the black liquid into, into the body are at the precipice of success. The womb is the key. A pure soul proves to be highly malleable and adaptive, and adaptive subject. Six years. I have named these scarred, these scar, sacred larvae, larvae carried into the womb of the chosen U-I-I, after my own. Ah, uh, so this is basically the creation of the uh, Novista doors. Original, there is a giant nest right here. Damn it! Much as I want to see that new death animation, I'll pass. Uh... Wow, they camouflage. And yeah, I just noticed that, right as I pass. Oh my god, fuck off! Honestly, dude.
Yeah, real subtle. Yeah, it's getting low, I know. I fucking saw you last second to... If I could just not fucking eat shit once, that'd be nice. Yeah, honestly, yeah. There we go. You fucking just... Wow, right in front of where I went to roll, huh? Okay, okay, Capcom.
Yeah, one downside with having blind brutes is that they can't tell you a different from enemies. They can't identify you. I think this is a good place to leave this off at, so... Well, my brother did say that during his hardcore run of this game, that section is where he spent the most time dying, facing down those two wolverines, while ten guys are trying to kill you at the exact same time. So, thank you all for watching this episode. Consider subscribing, it's free, and you can always change your mind later on. And who knows, you might enjoy sticking around. But until then, thank you all for watching, and I will see all of you in the next chapter. Have a good night.